video, I will show you how to add multiple IP addresses to one SPF record on DigitalOcean. So without further ado, let's jump straight into it. I ca you can see here that I've got my DigitalOcean account open on the screen. Now this is a, a demo account that I use for my YouTube channel and tutorials such as this. So before I add a text record or an SPF record to this account, let's talk about what an SPF record actually is. So it stands for Send a Policy Framework and it is a DNS record that specifies the approved mail servers that can send mail on behalf of your domain. So dodgy email spammers will send mail from their server, but they will forge the from address to your domain. Now this is called a fake sender address. Now you can imagine this causes you a whole plethora of problems, time and money to name a few, right? So an SPF record can stop this as recipients from your email can refer to the record to make sure that the mail has come from an approved mail server. So why do we want two IP addresses on one SPF record? Well, not all apps, not all web apps will run on a single IP address. You might have multiple subdomains. Those subdomains might sit on different droplets or servers in this instance. So you'll have different IP addresses. Now you might want to send an email from your auth application when people sign up. You might want to send notification emails from your main app, which sits on a different IP address. That's why we want to have the ability to add more than one IP address to that SPF record. Now, this example that I've got on my screen here, you can see quite easily that I've got one IP address here, which is my auth IP address. I've got another one here, which is my main. Can you see that at the bottom there, 138? That's my main IP address. So this is the example account that I'm going to use. And adding an SPF record needs to be no more difficult than adding an MX record or an A record or a C name. Okay, very, very easy. You click on it. In this case, we click on TXT and we add a string. Now I've already written a string so we can just walk through. Uh, you can see what it says is V equals FPF1. You then reference A, you then reference MX. And then what you do is you put the IP4 semicolon then put the IP address of it doesn't it, there's it, there's no need to have an order just put any IP address that appears in your um, on your DigitalOcean account and then have a space and do the same again for the other IP address and then at the end here you have include and then you add the mail server uh, that you're using or mail service that you're using and I, in this case I use Google but you can use Outlook in which case you'd put the right um, name of the service provider here and then dash all that is the string you need you need no more in there put at in there which will reference your host name which is diddemo.com in my instance ttl is 3600 create record that is all there is to it it's very very easy all you need to do is add that dns record to your account and it's all good so let's just recap quickly i've just gone through how to add or include more than one IP address to an SPF record. And we've talked about what an SPF record actually is and the importance of including an SPF record on your DigitalOcean account. It essentially stops spammers from sending emails on your behalf. So thank you very much for watching. I've enjoyed making this video. I hope it's been beneficial and I'll see you again soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.